Hey everybody, it's time to get out and wander. We are here at Big Sandy Trailhead in the Wind River Range. Um, it's uh, September 10th, 2021, and we're getting ready to backpack. We're going to uh, head up to Big Sandy Lake, take a couple nights there, do some day hikes up to the Cirque of the Towers, go over to Dad's Lake, do some more day hiking, and uh, stay there two nights. We're gonna get to do something that uh, got interrupted in July. Looking forward to this trip. So we'll uh, see you on down the road. Well, we seem to have gotten a stellar day today. The sun is shining. The smoke is still up in the mountains. So that's unfortunate. Um, we were expecting a little bit cooler weather. I thought the forecast said maybe mid 60s today. And I'm gonna say at the trailhead if it wasn't 80, it was pushing it, but still, it's a nice day, and uh, working our way up this trail, heading for Big Sandy Lake. And here's a shout out to the trail crews that keep these trails open. My gosh, there was a lot of down timber. So once again, thank you for keeping the trails open. I tell you, can it get any better than that? So we made our hike into Big Sandy Lake and it is a very easy hike. Uh, if you're not even thinking about it, you may not even notice how much the, uh, you're going up. So the elevation gain to Big Sandy from the trailhead isn't all that great. Have a nice little spot behind me there. Got our tent set up and here is our view. At the moment, there's some rumbling going on in the clouds. Not sure if we're going to have any thunderstorms or rain tonight. But uh, tomorrow will be another day. See you then. So we're very fortunate that we got here early enough, set up the tent, and got everything packed away because we are in a downpour. There's a thunderstorm going on out there. Lightning, thunder, booming, raining hard. So, yeah, it's fortunate that we're here safe and sound. And I wanted to show you a picture of our kitchen. So we got a number of rocks here that work off of for cooking, getting food prepped. And one of the best things of this site and the sites around it they put a bear box in.
So we're heading up to the Cirque today. Staying at Big Sandy again tonight. We're just doing a day trip. And it is a beautiful, glorious day. Got the sun out. It's a decent temperature. Oh, the views are just beautiful. Absolutely stunning. Well, that's a wrap for our trip to Big Sandy Lake and the Wind Rivers. We're all packed up. Camp's clean. Bags are done. And we're ready to roll. Going to head to the trailhead and thinking about spending the, a night in Pinedale. One last look at Big Sandy Lake. Today we're visiting Fremont Lake, just outside of Pinedale, Wyoming. Where we are right now is uh, we're going to visit CCC Ponds. And this spot is one of the largest mule deer migrations in uh, North America. Uh, there's some kind of bottleneck and this is where they all are funneled to to get from their north and south ranges not been here before so let's go see what the CCC ponds look like. So this was the site of the Camp Fremont from the CCC back in the 1930s. It opened in 1933 and the men signed up and they worked for one to two years. They made $30 a month and 25 was deducted and sent back home which was good for the people back home. And then most of the people, kids here, were from Ohio. So they said it was a different landscape for them. And it was self-sufficient, it had a doctor, they had newspaper, but they also went into town and had dances and stuff. And some of the men stayed and married local girls. So one other piece of history about the CCC ponds, the small bar barracks that they had out here for the guys. Some of them were purchased by Gannett Peak Motel. And if you're in Pinedale, you could stay at some of those old uh, CCC barracks. Got them fixed up pretty nice. Look how clear that water is. We took the trail that said duck pond, and then at the next sign, we took the trail that said dam. And this is the outlet from Fremont Lake. And they use a dam here to channel some of the water to the CCC ponds. big brown thing at rock. How fortunate was that? We just saw a moose back there off the trail. So just 
just shows you that you never know what can what you're gonna see so don't forget to get out and wander see ya